Um, okay. Well, let's just turn that off. All right. This place is called Calf Rounder. Oh yeah, and before I forget, what's up guys? Get roasted here. All right, so the CEO is showing me around and he can fly, which is nice, I guess. I'm just trying to figure out what exactly is happening here. So it's a cafe based on a spaceship. Quote, this cafe is very unique compared to the other ones you have seen on Roblox since this is a more of a out of this world type situation, end quote. I mean, they get points for being original, I guess, but when you think about this, this is actually really retarded. Okay, so let's look at the menu. Regular, double, triple, what? What? Yeah, uh, can I get a double beverage? That feeling when you're the CEO, but you work the front desk. Also notice the lack of register or any kind of money storage system. I guess aliens don't need money when they fuck themselves in the ass all they are. I like to point out the fact that the CEO is also the only employee on the employee points board. Also pointing out the fact that this place only has 1.3 thousand visits at the time of recording, which means that the CEO alone would have had to serve every single customer, including himself, 10 times over. Or just cheated to get those points. It's what some people would say. Not to mention these fucking shit menus that like to trap you in and don't allow you to close them. TBH, I'm not even gonna try and read this just because he chose a background color that's basically identical to the text in the foreground. So, like, why? What are you doing, kid? I don't really want to go back to the musical aspect of this place, but just because I have to... Nah, not really, you just got roasted. Now looking at the uniform that just consists of a vest and woman's leggings, you begin to ask the question, is this cafe really owned by aliens, as the owner would want you to believe, or just a retarded 12 year old who doesn't understand the concept of time, and or the concept of friends, and no spending that concept of time with your concept of friends, but instead decides to work on shitty calf projects like this one. Okay, for the next clip I'm about to show you, pay attention to my hand and its contents really closely. You see that? Do you see that? All right, rewind that shit real quick. So you're telling me that this light brush with the bin completely cleared my inventory of any cookies that I had. Did I have to get this fucking dickhead points for? Now I gotta go give his broke ass some more points to get another fucking cookie. Fuck you. Miss, that happens to be a lovely baby you're holding. The TBH was more like. This is the type of place you would bring your robot girlfriend, she would break up at you. Something that's even more ridiculous than the way this place removes cookies is the way that they give you them. If he's just going to use the dispenser, then why not make a serve yourself area? You're literally putting in no work to make these cookies, which would give nobody in the world, or galaxy in this case, any reason whatsoever to come to this IFC for food. And I'd like someone to explain to me how such a big cookie can come out of such a small hole. What could be next? Sticking to the topic of dispensers, I'd like you to turn your attention to the cake dispensers. It took us a while to figure it out, but we eventually managed to do it. The way these cake dispensers are supposed to work is you're supposed to put your penis through the little hoop and, and tug on it with all your might, then a cake comes out of it, basically. I was curious as of how these actually work, so I decided to order a cake to see a demonstration of this process happening. And not to my surprise, it wasn't completely retarded or anything. Sarcasm. And apparently it's okay to put the human equivalent of a floating fetus in the middle of a dining room. Can you guess the mystery substances in the back of the cafe? I wanna know. So whatever they have back there is so secret that you can't even access it through a door. This cafe is so bad that they have security guards just to stop the people from committing suicide. Oh man, I don't want them finding out this secret. The fuck is this? Let's not forget the eating music.